Welcome, dear students, in the next lecture of uh, basic accounting uh, lecture series. In this part, uh, we will uh, discuss the objectives of uh, accounting. Objective means uh, the target where we have to go and what we have to achieve with the help of accounting. We have very solid targets which we can achieve with the help of accounting. First to record the business transactions. There is a limit of our brain to record anything. I can remember 10 to 20 transactions of my small business but it is a very very difficult to record 1 million transactions in a one day at that time we need the scientific rules and regulation of accounting to have to have to follow in our business for recording the millions of transactions in a day second our objective to know the net profit or net loss Accounting uh, makes the records and uh, this record will calculate what is the value of uh, our net profit or net loss which uh, we have achieved in the uh, our accounting period. This period may be uh, one month, quarterly or one year. What is the amount we have? achieved from uh, our performance uh, from our trading the business uh, for providing the services uh, after uh, calculating the total uh, revenues and uh, total expenses so this is our second target which we have to achieve with the help of accounting third to know the financial position of business what is the position of uh, our business at uh, uh, what level level we are swimming suppose you have to start the swimming and you see the level of the water is more than from you and you are, you do not know uh, how to swim so it is a chance you will uh, uh, fall down in the water so before uh, uh, saving this factor you have to swim uh, on low water like this uh, in the business uh, you have to see the risk what is the risk and uh, this risk we can know from our financial position suppose we have taken a uh, large quantity of loan but uh, our fixed asset is uh, are very low or we uh, our invested uh, cash in the current asset uh, will become uh, in the form of loss so these assets value will be zero so this will tell our balance sheet and balance sheet will be uh, made by uh, accounting system and th uh, fourth our target is uh, to now the tax liabilities in a country in which uh, your business uh, is uh, growing the next next steps at that time you have to follow the regulation of the government and uh, laws and uh, one of the most uh, strong law is income tax you have to pay it so tax liability can be calculated after calculating the net profit so if uh, our target is to calculate the net profit then our target is also to calculate the net tax liability without uh, accounting a record we cannot calculate the tax liability to now the balance of account receivable and account payable account receivable we sell the goods on credit and we have to take the money and uh, account payable is the amount which we have to pay because we buy the goods on credit so 
what is uh, its position how much money we have to give uh, to our uh, creditors and how much money we have to uh, take from our debtors so this will tell the total accounts of the debtors and total accounts of creditors and we calculate the net amount which we have to pay or which we have to get to provide the information to interested parties there are lots of parties which use accounting information for different ways suppose I am a scholar and I am doing the research of uh, the level of uh, economy level of the national income if uh, I know the, the one business income and I know different business income corporate business income through their financial uh, statements their income statements I can estimate national income of my business business for my research purpose so this is the just one interested party there are lots of parties creators debtors employees all are selfish for their targets so their targets will achieve with the accounting information okay so these are the objectives of the accounting which any businessman has to achieve okay thank you very much